Measuring ingredients accurately is an important step in baking because the quality of the baked products rely on this step. To measure ingredients properly, you need the right measuring tools. For small batches of baking, you will need a measuring cup or jar to measure liquid ingredients, measuring spoons for small amount of ingredients, measuring cup for dry ingredients, regular spoon to scoop in the ingredients, metal spatula to level off the ingredients, and sieve to sift the flour. How to measure flour? Step 1. Sift the flour to remove lumps or big particles. Through sifting, air is also incorporated which contributes to a lighter mixture and easier mixing. Be ready with your measuring cup and metal spatula and a spoon to scoop in your ingredients into the measuring cup. Step 2. Use spoon to move flour to the measuring cup until it overflows. Step 3. Level off the rim of the cup using a spatula or any straight edge tool. Do not shake or tilt the cup while scooping the flour because you will compress the ingredients and can get extra measure for the flour. Another no-no in measuring flour is scooping the flour directly by the measuring cup. You will also get extra measure for the flour by doing this. How to measure white sugar? Step 1. Spoon sugar to the measuring cup. Step 2. Level it off using a spatula or any straight edge tool. Do not top the sugar to avoid having it compressed inside the cup. How to measure brown sugar? Step 1. Remove any unwanted particles. While doing this, you can also remove the lumps. Step 2. Place enough amount of sugar on a cup until it gets compact. Level it off using a spatula or any straight edge tool. It can hold its shape because it's compressed. How to measure baking soda? Step 1. Remove the lumps. Step 2. Dip the spoon. And step 3. Level it off. Measure baking powder. Measuring baking powder is the same process as measuring baking soda. How to measure butter? Butter is the easiest to measure since this one pack is already equivalent to one cup. If you cut this in half, you will get two one half cup measure of butter. How to measure shortening or solid fats? Step 1. Soften the shortening. I do not have shortening so I use softened butter for this demonstration. Step 2. Fill the measuring cup and press firmly until there is no space left. And step 3, level off using a spatula or any straight edge tool. How to measure liquid ingredients? Step 1, 
Place the jar in a flat surface before pouring any liquid ingredients to be measured. Step 2. Get down on eye level and gradually pour liquid to the measuring cup. And step 3. Check if the desired measurement has been taken. We try to measure 2 cups of water here, but since we cannot get the view of the camera on level with the 2 cup measure, it looked like we exceeded the 2 cup line. And that's it for measuring ingredients for baking.